And welcome back, everyone. Joining us this morning, we have Amy Yart. How are you from uh, UPU Health Run for Life? Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Now, for folks who aren't familiar with the Run for Life, what is it all about? The Run for Life is an event that we put on. This is our fourth annual. And what we're doing is we're getting people together. It's to promote organ and tissue donation, you know, for a great cause. And, you know, also to have an event that mm -hmm. gets people out there in a healthy way. Sure. Now, the course, what kind of a course do you have set? I mean, is it really, really long? Or what kind of people can get involved with this? We have a 10K, a 5K, and a walk. Oh, okay. And then we also have a kids run. So there's... There's something for everyone. So in other words, saying, well, I'm not much of a runner is not much of an excuse. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> they have to get involved. Now, is it one of those races where uh, people should like gather up like their friends and families and get uh, like uh, donations attached to what they're doing? That is a possibility. We okay. do send out for the kids race. We send out to the Marquette Public Schools a flyer where, you know, the kid can bring it to grandma and grandpa okay. and their aunts and uncles and raise a little bit of money and then we have awards and prizes for them. Okay, well that makes it kind of fun. Yes. Now do you still need sponsors or uh, rather uh, volunteers to get involved on this? We are looking good for sponsors and volunteers. Okay. The one thing we are looking for is a photographer. Oh, okay. So we still need a photographer yes. on this. All right. So if they need to get a hold of you, they can do that. Now, if people still want to participate, can they still sign up to actually run or walk in the event? Yes, they can. Absolutely. We accept registrations through superior timing up to Friday at 2 p.m. Mm -hmm. And then Friday evening, we will have our bag pickup where we also have registrations, and that's being held at Synergy Fitness from 4 to 7 p.m. Okay. And then we accept registrations the day of. All right, and I see the, it's going to be right at the Mats in Lower Harbor Park. So, I mean, that's just a beautiful area anyway. It is, and that's, you know, that's a part of it. You're, you're running along the lake, whether you do the 5K, 10K, or you walk, it's a beautiful view. It's going to be a fantastic time, no matter what the weather. Rain or shine? Rain or shine. <laughs> okay. Well, I want to thank you again for letting us know a little bit more about the UP Run for Life and how people can get involved and help out others in the community. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Amy. And I'll tell you what, coming up, speaking of helping things out, Ashley Kirkland is at Knots and Kisses. And if you need right. a little bit of help with You're your good. next party, well, that she's going to give us some tips in a minute. <laughs>